po natin ang energy at presensya ng bawat isa. Can we ask to open your cam? Ayan. Can we ask to open your cam para makita po natin yung mga naggagandahan at nagwagwapuhan participants natin. Ayan. So thank you for opening your cam. Ayan. From Excite Credit Cooperative. Ayan. Sa CDA po to. And from Online Community Credit Cooperative, Ms. Justine Ferrer. Ayan. Hello. And yes. Ayan. Ilan pa yung nakikita ko? So we have a new classmate. Ayan. And yes. Oh, sino dito na kahit anong gawin natin, eh walang paramdam? Meron ba? <laughs> Parang yung ginawa niya sa'yo. Charot. Ayan. So whatever it is, We want to honor again and acknowledge everyone for choosing to be here today. We know it's Friday and maybe may mga kailangan tayong tapusin kasi andyan na na naman ang compliance. Ayan. And reminder, nakapag-receive na po ba kayo ng compliance report nyo sa BIR? Ayan, nakapagpatatak na po ba tayo? Hindi pa po ba? And thank you and you choose to stay with us. And syempre, Uh, it means lang naman talaga na um, yung commitment po natin, yung uh, pagiging excellence po natin sa ating co-op ay nagpapakita na meron po tayo dito. And rest assured that this meeting is worth of your time. At mamaya po, i-discuss po natin. May bago po tayong picture. Ayan, makikilala nyo po siya. Ayan, may, uh, pas tahimik lang po siya ngayon pero mamaya, ayan, gugulatin niya po tayo. And syempre, so today wala po ang ating Honorable Regional Director, Ms. Marietta P. Wang. Ayan, para makapagbigay po ng message sa atin. And yes, let's go na to our, ayan, the man behind ARCS, the CEO and founder of IOL Incorporated, Sir Kevin Philip Gayao. Sir Kevin. So good morning. So it's a... Uh... Nang pagkagsapak niya yung amin, ano, it's really, uh, siguro, I'm not sure, everyone is busy because of their compliance um, compliance requirements. Di ba? Nandito po yung isa po natin kasama from CDA. <laughs> so, um, so every, everyone is uh, quite busy. So, we really appreciate, sabi nga ni Jeremy kanina, we would like to really uh, express our gratitude for you taking your time uh, of your very busy schedule Ano, to be part of this learning session. Um, I guess, I, I mean, uh, the the compliance requirements are really, um, I, fe I feel is becoming more and more difficult, di ba? Lumigrigat. Um, um, that's the reason why we have ARCs. You know? We have developed ARCs. The main goal of ARCs is to make it easier on your end. Ano, to create, ano, to, to publish and generate those required uh, regulatory reports by the regulators, uh, the CDA in particular. Ano, um, so um, we also would want to thank you ano, for your feedback. Napakalaking tulong po ano, ng mga feedback in the past uh, four weeks. Um, especially dun pa lang sa onboarding process, pagdagdag ng members. etc. Nag-improve ng gusto yung ating system because of that. And we also made some changes to how um, we will do uh, membership onboarding in the future. So very thankful po kami sa inyong mga feedback. Uh, we've also um, made some uh, improvements on the experience, on how it looks, and you know, the system looks on your end. So um, significantly nag-improve ano, yung ating system. I think And uh, I honestly believe um, wala na po kayong makikitang available software available in the country with the, the power and the capability that we are offering now. Ano? And uh, ang swerte nyo po dahil free po lahat ito. Ano? So in the future, this will no longer be free. Ano? Um, but of course, there will always be um, concessions or special, special palagi yung pilot um, cooperatives namin. It's just unfortunate that one uh, cooperative, although large naman po sila, so um, have uh, signified your, their intention to back out from their agreement, uh, from the tripartite agreement. So we're just waiting ano, for their official uh, information. Pero that also means that we're opening one more slot 
ano baka po may kakilala po kayo na cooperative na gustong uh, maging part po ng ating uh, type uh, maging part ng system ano baka pwede niyo pong i-refer sa amin ano at para may matulungan din po natin sila also it is uh, general assembly time di ba uh, pag declare ng dividendo <laughs> ng mga uh, patronage refund. So I guess that's one, one of the things that also makes you busy. And again, through ARCs, kung nasimulan nyo na pong naggamit yan, makikita nyo po, it will be a lot easier to compute for for these things, ano, yung mga percentages, dahil nga nandyan na from entry to um, entry to uh, to the accounting reports. Um, and also, it's it would be easier to get information or data regarding the Ano, the ledgers of each member. Napakadali. We made it so easy. Um, search, search na lang po. We've introduced um, yung tinatawag nilang global search. Tapos meron din po tayo yung mga localized search. Meaning, pwede po kayo mag-search on a global scale within the system or pwedeng doon po sa mismong mga members ninyo. Madaling makuha yung data po nila. So, all of this, we're making it as easy as possible. Ano, so, I hope Ano, na next year, kapag meron pong mga webinars in the first quarter of next year, game na game po kayo mag dahil nga tapos nyo na yung mga reports. Okay, that's our aim, that's our goal for the ARCs. Ano, to make your lives easier so you could focus on the things that matter. That is growing your cop and helping more of your, uh, more people, uh, particularly your members. So, um, and I think Yung mga iba po sa inyo nag-attend na rin ano, recently doon po sa webinar or sa consultation ng CDA din regarding the upcoming memorandum circular regarding the policy guidelines uh, requiring co-ops to maintain a list of active and inactive members. Again, uh, we're actually in process of making that possible through the ARCs ulit. Okay, so, yun ang kagandahan. We're very... Um, um, let's just say proactive when it comes to all of this you know, because we want to work with the CDA, the regulator, and we would want it to make it easier on your end you know, to submit the reports. Kahit na uh, uh, may sariling system si CDA, yung CAIS, you know, at least we're, uh, we we can make the generation of the date, details that is required for the CA, uh, the CAIS you know, um, from the ARCs a lot easier. You know? So, Yun po yung goal. Ano, siguro ngayon hindi nyo pa nakikita ano, uh, lahat ng benefits nito and I mentioned this before. It will take time. Ano, ilang months na from the last time that we met uh, face to face, di ba? And not all of you are fully integrated. That's okay. That's okay. Normal lang po yan. Ano, dahil yung future benefits, ano, mag magchachaga po tayo ng ilang buwan, ano, ng ilang, ilang linggo. Ano, because it's, it's ano, change is always difficult. Ano, However, um, this, I think, will benefit you over the long term if you are able to change or, or, or um, uh, transition to the ARCs. Ano, yun yung masakit ngayon, pero yung benefit naman over the long term for your cooperative will be substantial. Ano? So again, I want to reiterate, excited na po kaming implement yung active at saka inactive no classification this would also help you with your uh, with you maintaining your uh, certificate of uh, tax exemption with the BIR because uh, the BIR was the one who uh, basically uh, prodded the CDA you know, regarding this one so at least compliant din tayo sa BIR level so nakita nyo po it's becoming um, uh, more voluminous yung kailangan natin or dumadami yung kailangan nating i-comply to maintain our uh, status as um, uh, compliant ano, um, cooperative but um, that's the reason why we're here ano? that's the reason why ARCS was created to make it a lot easier for you to to maintain your status as a compliant um, cooperative and of course uh, the corresponding benefits tax benefits especially um, also, I would want to announce, ano, siguro napansin nyo, for some, for some of you who have been using the system, there is already a regular maintenance schedule every Fridays po. Ano, Fridays 8pm to Mondays 10am, yun po yung ating regular maintenance schedule. Uh, from time to time, we have, um, during the week, 
um, possible na magkaroon po ng mga emergency uh, patch updates. Um, but ang regular na maintenance schedule po natin is Fridays to Mondays. No? So often after Friday, pag gising nyo po ng Sabado, tapos i-check nyo po yung system, usually may bago. Ano, may 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 changes no so expect na every week we will do that um also um we'll also our, we'll, ha, we'll be having our next deep dive i think treasure na yung pag-uusapan natin na role uh, in the next um schedule which is after the holy week na po april 22 yung tentative na date po natin so thank you very much for being with us um again uh, we appreciate you being here uh, despite all of the um, the busyness of the season. You know? uh, GA, um, BIR, CDA. You know? But uh, please do understand also that it is important for us to continuously learn. You know? If we truly love our cooperative, if we truly love you know, our fellow members, it is through um, continuous learning and in um, chaga. Ano, uh, grip eh, towards uh, shifting to a more uh, digital environment wherein we can really see significant changes and improvements in our cooperatives over the long term, creating more value for everyone. Ano, so uh, thank you very much for, for being here. And uh, ayan, back to you, Jeremy. Yes, ayan, ayan. Thank you, Sir Kevin. Ayan, so marami talaga. No? So uh, busy season talaga ngayon. And ayan, sabi nga ni Sir Kevin Pinina for uh, for the pilot co-op, ayan, magiging special po tayo sa sa kanila. And maybe for the second time around, sana maging free ulit. <laughs> ayan, kasi baka may bayad na sa susunod na mga co-op. And anyways, and thank you for your feedback to our dear pilot co-op dahil sa inyo, ayan gumaganda na ang ating system and akalain mo maglalagay ka lang ng data and bahala na yung system mag-generate ng report para sa atin di ba uh, just imagine na ayun yung oras nababawasan yung oras sa paggugo so siguro sa isang linggo mga dalawang araw mo na gagawin yung report na yan and okay so right now yan we have the presenter and presenting to you the presenter today. Ayan. Sir Kurt and Sir Jester. Okay. So our presenters, yes, you have now the spotlight. Go, Kurt. Ayan. Thank you, Jeremy, for, ano, for the introduction. And so nagbabalik ako as the, the person to discuss yung first part. So... So I'll just introduce po yung discussions. So number one, meron po tayong recap and discussion of the new features and some updates then po about yung nangyayari po sa ARCS development. Um, deep dive into the credit committee role. So specifically yung overview of the credit committee role, loan application process, loan application status, loan categories, and savings account categories. So pagkatapos nun po, meron po ulit tayo mga hands-on activities. Okay lang po na hindi makasabay. Uh, pwede nyo pong i-refer tong video na to once that the recordings are ready. And then meron rin po kaming Q&A sections kung meron po kayong mga katanungan during the, the discussions. And ulit, meron po tayong quiz taking and feedback form. So yung quiz po, hindi po namin... Hindi po siya, ano, wala po siyang impact doon sa grade ninyo or wala po tayong grades dito. We just want to know po yung kung, kung nagigets ba po yung mga ano, discussions so that we can improve over time. Okay, so so before we start, um, this session is designed for the credit committee role. So, so hopefully yung mga nandito po sa meeting na to ay kasama sa credit committee role. And kung hindi naman, siya po yung nagmamanage ng mga credit credit services natin sa kooperatiba. And, and also, um, mga paalala lang, uh, be sure to mute your audio by default and only unmute if called or want to ask a question. Um, expect to apply what you've learned. So meron po tayong mga hands-on activities 
as said before, nung, la, nung kanina. And don't worry, uh, kapag meron pong mga ano, kapag may mga mga issues, errors, or problems po tayo nakikita, uh, sabihin niya lang po habang ginagawa pa yung mga activities, okay lang po. And if you get lost during the discussions, pwede niyo pong balikan mamaya once or later on kapag ready na po yung mga recordings. So, simulan na po tayo. Let's begin. Ayan. So, recap of last time. So, ito po yung ano, sa Deep Dive of Membership Committee. So, meron po dyan yung mga kasama ko. Si Jeremy, si CJ, si, si Jester, si Amiel, at saka si Kevin. And then, meron po, nag-on camera, si Timber and Lime, sa represented by Sir Billy, Ma'am Shella, Uh, meron din po si Mother Yam at saka si Excite, si Ma'am Karil po. Ayan. So meron po yung mga kasama rin po natin dyan, yung mga hindi nag ng camera. Ayan. Maraming salamat po sa pag-attend ng last activities natin. And of course, nung, nung Monday po, uh, pumunta po kami doon sa Timber and Lime for a face-to-face face-to-face training kung meron po mga ano, clarifications doon sa ano, paggamit ng system or mga issues with regards to onboarding um, may i call ko meron po dito si Sir Billy Joe Meron po ba? <laughs> Ayun. So hello, good good morning Sir Billy. Morning sir. So so binisita po namin yung Timber and Lime nung Monday po. Uh, hindi ko lang napun- na ilagay yung picture dito sa ano sa presentation. Um musta naman po yung ano yung paggamit po ng system Sir Billy? Um, so far, sir, okay yun naman siya. Mm. Uh, medyo inaka- inagamay-gamay pa namin, sir, para mas ma-enhance yung paggamit ng system. Opo. Ayan. So, thank you po sa, pag, ano, sa pagtanggap sa amin nung Monday. Um, na- uh, nag-enjoy naman po kami sa, ano, sa, mga, sa mga nangyari nung, ano, nung Monday po. Um, and then hopefully nakatulong po si Jester sa membership membership committee ninyo po doon sa ano sa co-op. <laughs> Ayan. So thank you po Sir Billy. Um, so ayoko na pong patagalin yung ano yung discussions. So bagong features po tayo. So before tayo magsimula doon sa deep dive. Ayan. So sa account related, ito po yung mga pag-login, pag-sign up both sa co-op at saka sa Tsaka sa user, lahat po ng verification code masisenda po doon sa mobile number. It's because of the the issues regarding email addresses. Kaya po namin, kaya nag-implement kami ng bagong system na kung saan lahat ng verification codes natin magsisend po sa mobile number. So, kailangan lang natin po ng phone para, para lagi po tayong, ay para matanggap lang natin po yung mga verifications. So, text lang sa atin. And then, yung mga minor minor corrections lang, mga spelling corrections sa sign up, um, nag-reflect na po yung board reso kapag nilagay, dinagdag po siya dun sa profile ng member. At saka yung mga news feeds po natin, nakasort na po from the top yung mga pinakabago. Alright, so treasure naman po, uh, tinago lang po namin yung product section kapag blank po siya. So, ganun po yung itsura niya. And then, the reason why is para mas malinis lang tignan. <laughs> Ayan. So, credit committee. So, may bagong feature po tayo dito. Yung pag-view, edit, create ng savings category. And then, yung loan cards. Uh, tinago lang po rin namin yung reason kung bakit siya empty. So, ganito po itsura niya. Ayan. So, ganyan. <laughs> I mean. And bakit namin ginawa to? Kasi it's a new feature. New feature po na ipapakita ko mamaya. And then yung sa loan cards, only show relevant information to maintain a clean design. And then sa member, member role naman, um, may bagong features po na kung saan yung mga inflow transactions such as deposits, um, mga, yung mga deposits po natin on request ng withdrawal, pwede na po siyang gawin either. Ay, wala pa po. Hindi pa po available yung sa ARCs, pero available na po yung sa direct to co-op na options. 
And then meron po yung savings page. Um, inayos lang po namin yung spelling ng mga mga wrong spelling dun sa ano, system. So ito po yung itsura niya. So kapag mag-make ng deposit, magpa-pay ng bills, ganun po yung mangyayari. And then you can see over the counter, yan po yung sa ano, diretso sa co-op. While yung isang option po, dinedevelop pa po namin para mas convenient, para hindi na po pupunta dun in person sa co-op. And then ganito po yung itsura ng savings. Pwede na pong mag-apply for new savings accounts. Yeah. So sa accountant naman po, mga mga fixes lang po yung ginawa rin po ni, namin dito. So yung mga filters ng account titles, yung multiple entries, hindi nagde-display na naayos na rin po yan. And then yung interface updates or yung itsura niya has been updated para ma-accommodate po yung journal entries tsaka complete, complete yung details na nakikita. Ayan, so ganito po itsura niya. Ayan. So yun sa account titles. And then yung sa cards. Alright, so simulan po natin dun sa credit committee dashboard. Okay, so kung, kung, mas, kung masyado ako mabilis, please let me know. Kasi pag minsan binibilisan ko talaga yung discussion because we only have around 3 hours. And gusto ko po sanang mag-proceed tayo agad dun sa sa hands-on activities. Ayan, so simulan po natin. So the credit committee dashboard. So the credit committee is responsible for checking loan applications and loan payments. So yung user na to, kaya niya pong mag-view, approve and reject loan applications, track and archive loan payments. This is for future updates kasi inaayos pa siya. And create, view, edit. Savings account and loan categories. Okay, so sino po ang gagamit ng, ng credit committee? So the person assigned must be a member of the credit committee of the cooperative or siya po yung nagmamanage ng credit operations natin. Ayan, so loan categories. So loan categories, ito po yung, yung loan service ng cooperative na provide niya po sa kanyang members. Mga examples dito, mga housing loans, auto loans, agricultural loans, educational loans, and so on and so forth. And so dito sa loan categories, yung kayo yung yung taong may kaya lang i-edit to, I see credit co committee. So so kapag may mga changes, i-refer niyo na lang po kay credit yung mga ito or mga questions about that. And then sa loan category options, so if, before ko ipakita po yung kung paano siya gawin, i-introduce ko lang po yung mga, yung mga options na pwede nyo pong galawin aside from the name and description. So loanable amounts, so pwede nyo pong i-edit yung range, yung minimum and maximum loanable amounts dun sa ating, sa ating mga loans. And then... Pwede po tayong magdagdag ng co-maker, yung mga taong kasama ni applicant na mag apply ng loan. Uh, loan interest, so, so ito yung interest per interest. One, two, three, go. Ayan. So the interest rate per interest term. So ito po, by interest term, specifically yung monthly, quarterly, by annually and annual interest term, at saka yung interest rate. Ito yung po yung mga percentages ng ating loan. And then penalty, uh, penalty charge for or overdue and late payments. So penalty charge can either be fixed amount, 500 pesos for example, or percentage of the loan, example mga 1% of the loan amount. So similarly, meron rin po tayong service fee na kinokollect ng co-op for processing yung loan applications. So it can either be a fixed amount or percentage of the loan. And then we also have the other fees. So additional fees collected by the co-op from the member for availing the loan. So required po dito. So ito is naging suggestion to from the first training session uh, kung saan may mga fees po na kinokollected din ang co-op na not necessarily yung 
yung service fee natin. So, other fees. So, naidagdag tong feature ng other fees. So, this can be the name, yung title, yung name of the fee, and then yung amount kung magkano yung i-charge, at saka yung description po ng fee na to. And then, we also have other requirements, additional requirements na kinakailangan. Though, ito is more on the writing, kung ano po yung mga kailangan, such as documents, receipts, IDs, and so on and so forth. So, paano ba ito gawin? So, paano ba gumawa ng isang loan category? So, punta lang po sa settings. And then, click add loan categories. Para i or i-edit yung loan kapag kailangan nyo. Sa so second option naman tayo. And then, kapag gagawa po tayo ng bago, makikita nyo po yung form dito sa, sa left side. And po yung makikita ninyo if gusto nyo pong mag-add or mag-edit ng loan categories. And then once na matapos nyo po yung mga yung mga edits or yung pagdagdag ng mga information na kailangan or optional na mga information or possible updates, pwede nyo na pong i-save changes. Ayan. So the next one is yung pag-approve naman ng loan applications. So dito magtatawag po ako ng tao na pwede pong mag-volunteer para sagutin tong question na ito. So in order to approve a loan, a blank of the cooperative must have already made a loan application. So so host Jeremy, meron ka po ba dyan? Ah, wala ata. Uh, yes, nandito ako. Hmm? Ayun. Pwede ka bang magtawag from the audience kung sino ah. po ang pwedeng sumagot nito? Ang alam ko yung sasagot. So ayan, so I have the... Ayan, so... Sempre. Ah, uh, in order to approve a loan. Ah, okay. So Miss Sunshine, are you there? Tinawag si Asawa. <laughs> Hello, good morning. Morning. Ayan, mahina yung boses mo. Okay na po ba? Ah, uh, medyo mahina pa rin. Medyo mahina pa rin. Mahina pa rin. Lumayo. Okay na. Mahina? Hello. Hello. Ayan. Hmm. Uh, in order to approve a loan, a member of the cooperative must have already made a loan application. All right. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Ayan, so tignan pa natin kung tama si Miss Sunshine. So, so yeah. Ayan, so correct pa si Miss Sunshine. Um, in order to approve a loan, a member of the cooperative must already have already created a loan application. Ayan, so congratulations Miss Sunshine. At sya ka, buti na lang, pinili mo si Miss Sunshine, Jeremy. You get a point as well. <laughs> Ayan, so... So ayan, so before po tayo mag-approve po ng loans, kailangan po talaga ng member application. Ayan, so it's a little obvious pero hopefully ano, this clarifies things then. <laughs> And kung paano po siya gawin on the member dashboard, ganito lang po. Ayan, so how to create a member application? First, punta lang po dun sa loans, apply loan under the member dashboard. And then, and then fulfill out po yung loan application form. And then after doing so, um, dapat, dapat i-check po natin yung agreement and the terms and conditions and privacy policy. And click submit kapag kompleto na po yung information na yan. And then pagkatapos nun po, i-try na po natin i-approve yung loan. So gagawin nyo hands-on to pala mamaya. So, tutulungan po kayo ni, ni Sir Jester mamaya. So, pagkatapos nun, switch role lang po tayo dun sa credit committee. And then, go to loan spending. And then, pagkatapos nun, kapag nasa pending na po kayo, view more info about the loan app application. So, makikita nyo po sa taas yung status. 
So yung pending approval on the date of and yung date of application. And then mag-iiba po yan to red or green kapag na-approve or na-decline po yung loan. So to approve the loan, click lang po yung approve. And then to decline the loan kapag may kulang, click decline. Ayan. So pagkatapos po siyang maging ma-approve or ayan, ma-approve, pupunta po siya dun sa pending treasurer's approval. So just to discuss more of the different application status natin dito sa dito sa loan applications eto po yan so we have first depending 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 status so may dalawa pong pending diyan as you can see may pending po tayo for credit at saka pending the treasurer's approval so pero kay ano kay treasurer treasurer makikita niya po diyan yung pending lang so wala pa yung pending ng credit Ayan. So, this indicates a loan application is awaiting approval from the credit committee, yung first pending. At saka yung second na pending po, this indicates that a loan has been approved by the credit committee and awaiting treasurer's approval for disbursement. So, bago po, like, ano, kung natandaan nyo po yung discussion about transactions from the first meeting, first, dadaan po yung, mag-apply po si member, then mag then i-approve na lang ni credit then pupunta dun sa treasurer then after ni treasurer pwede na po siyang may disburse babalik kay kay member and then next po dyan kapag na-approve na po ni treasurer the loan will be on active status so the loan has been approved and the requested amount has been given to the member. Yun po yung meaning ng active. And then yung decline naman po, this is kapag na, na, na decline ni credit committee. So we're talking about yung credit committee. Pero meron din po to sa treasurer dun sa, dun sa side niya. Ayan. So the last part of the... Ano, of of the discussions will be the saving category, savings category. So the savings account is a service that ARCS allows cooperatives to have bank-like capabilities and manage members' savings. So sa, sa options niya naman, makikita niyo po doon yung name of product. So ito yung name ng savings account category natin. Savings product. So, ito yung type of savings na gusto po natin gawin. And as of now, meron po tayong dalawa. So, the first one would be the savings account. So, this is a type of saving account that allows the members to request withdrawals from at, from at any time. So, itong savings account na to, sinasabi lang dito na this is like yung pag-keep your typical savings account sa banko na kung saan ito yung pwedeng mag-withdraw si, si member basta i-request niya lang for withdrawal at any time. And then this usually has a lower percentage compared to time deposits which, which is another type of savings account na kung saan yung account na to a member can apply for pero hindi po sila pwedeng mag-withdraw until mag expire po yung terms niya. For example, naglagay ka ng time deposit amount nung for 3 months, hindi po pwedeng i-withdraw during those 3 months. Makukuha mo lang yung pera na to after that. So, yung advantage naman nito is that mas mataas yung interest rate niya compared to the typical savings. And then yung description. So, Pwede pong i-edit yung information about the savings account category. And then minimum deposit. Kung mag, ito yung minimum deposit or maintaining balance ng savings category. And yung interest. So the interest rate for saving savings account. For an interest, you can modify the following. So yung interest term and then yung interest rate. So paano po gawin yung credit savings category? So first... Go to settings and under settings, select add new savings category. 
and then add the information needed and click save. And then yun po. Uh, I think I'm ano okay na ako dito sa ano, sa mga If you have any questions before we move on sa hands-on activities or any clarifications. Okay, mukhang wala. Um, so, ito po yung maging activities natin for for the credit committee. So, at first one, we are going to create a loan category. Second, mag apply po tayo. And then third, we will be creating a savings category. So, Jester? Ready na ba? Oh, I'm so ready na, ready na. All right. So, hello, hello, hello. Uh, thank you for ano, for tuning in and listening to the discussions. Ipapasa ko na po yung mic kay Sir Jester para ipakita nyo po yung hands-on activities na hindi discuss po natin dito. All right. <laughs> Ayun, sir. Sir, yung share screen ko na lang kagat. So good morning po ulit sa atin. Uh, so Jester Pedrosa po from IOL uh, Business Dev. So ako po laging tumatawag sa inyo at nagte-text. So let's start the presentation ay the hands-on demonstration. Hi. Hello. Okay na sir. So let me share my screen first. So, ay. Yan. So, okay na sir. So, first, um, since uh, first activity is to create a loan category. So, ang um, prerequisite for creating a loan category is uh, accountant. So, magsiset si accountant ng, ng service or product sa sa chart of accounts na na kailangan gamitin for the service. So first, let's log in an accountant account. Yeah, so sign in muna tayo. So first, let's go to accountant role. Log in po tayo. Yeah, so we are now log in as an accountant. So first, let's go to the ledger then products to create products or services. So um ngayon gagawa ako ng loan. So first ang gagawin natin is the product name. For example is um personal loan. Dito natin siya ilalagay. Personal loan. Then linked account is yung nasa chart of accounts which is loans receivable. Loans receivable lang i-click natin for the accountants din. So yung category, so pwedeng lagyan natin na loans slash credit. Yan. Yung anong category na gusto nyo ilagay. So then click add. So as you can see, success. Success. So magpa, dito sa baba, magpapakita yung mga products na na-input natin. So na-input ko yung personal loan, which is andito. So andito siya. So ibig sabihin, na-create na tayo ng, ng products for the co-op. Then let's switch to the the credit committee role para iset yung loan category na yun. So let's click. Okay. So we're logged in as a credit committee. So puna tayo sa loans. I mean settings. Settings then add loan category. Just like yung na-discuss ni Sir Kurt kanina. Okay. So select loan product. So, ito, create loan categories. So, first is the select loan product. So, ang ginawa nating loan product kanina is yung personal loan. So, dito, nalang natin, personal loan. Select loan product. Yan yung nasa accountant side. So, loan product. Personal loan. So, description. So, yun, um, description lang ng loan na nilagay nyo. Ay, yung product na nagawa. So, this is, uh, this is the description, for example, lang to sample lang description for a personal loan yan so dito na yung mga 
mga other informations like amount, minimum amount na pwedeng i-load ni member, maximum, interest terms, ay terms, interest, yan. So, lagay natin. So, ang, kunwari, ang minimum amount na pwede niyang i-load is 500 pesos at maximum is 5,000. Interest term, yan. Annually, by, by annual, quarterly. So, iset natin siya ng monthly. Um, interest, yan yung percent kung anong interest rate ng loan na, loan na ito. Number of co-makers, yan. Kung pwedeng isa, isa lang ilagay natin. Reference person, isa lang din. So, service fee, you can click fix or percentage. So, isa lang po ang pwede dyan. So, kung fix, ilagay nyo po yung transaction, ay service fee na ilalagay na nyo. So, 100 pesos. So, other fees, other fees could be like yung mga bank transaction fees, um, shipping fee, ganun. For example, ipapadala nyo yung pera. So, dito nyo po ilalagay yun. For example, ito, uh, bank transaction fees. Um, yung other fees is maximum of 12, ay 3. 3 ang pwede nyo may ilagay dito na other fees. So, yun ang kwan. maximum na pwede ilagay. Transaction fees. So, amount, for example, 200 pesos. Description, other banks. Other requirements, like kung mayroon pa kayong kailangan na requirement, requirements like ID, SSS, ganun, birth certificate kung kailangan nyo. So, dito rin siya ilalagay. So, isave natin siya. So, successfully save. So, kung gusto nyong i-view to or i-edit, um, punta lang ulit po kayo sa settings. Then, dito po, view or edit loan categories. So, for example, may discrepancy kayong nalagay. Dito nyo po i-edit siya. So, yan. For example, gusto nyo pa palang dagdagan yung maximum amount ng, ng loan. So, pwede nyo siyang edit po dito. Pwede nyo rin palitan yung description. So, save natin. So, pwede din siyang i-edit. So, so meron ng loan categories. Then, pupunta tayo sa member para mag-apply ng loan. So, si member, si easy member. Natin si easy. So, yan. So, as you can see, walang mga nakalagay dito na loans ang pending disbursement approved. So, to apply a loan as a member, let's go to loans and apply for loan. So, yan. So, um, typical na personal information ang i-input dito sa loan application. So, mag-input tayo ng mga, mga details. So, home ownership, years of state, monthly rent zero since home owned tayo. Union Bank. Account number. Sample lang po to. 000. 000. 000. Employment status. Lloyd Company I name. IOL. For example. Baguio City. Annual income. Sabi natin 120,000. Employment years. 5 years. Then, select loan type. So, dito nyo pwedeng iselect yung mga loan products na nakalagay sa, sa sa credit committee. So, kanina ginawa natin is yung personal loan. Click natin yung personal loan. So, ayan. Magpapagit yung loan information dito sa member. So, makita yung loan interest, other bank, ay, transaction fees, loanable amount. Ayan. Makita po siya dito. So, loan amount. So, i-input natin yung loan amount. For example, ang inilagay ko lang is 100. Hindi po siya mag-proceed. Mag-automatically 500 po siya since ito po yung minimum amount na kailangan i pwedeng i-loan dito sa loan na to. So, 12 months. Um, loan terms, yan. 6 months. Natin 6 months. Pwede natin to ng 5,000. So, purpose, like, yun, kung anong purpose nyo for loaning, for example, to buy 
personal things. Ganyan. Co-maker. So, co-maker, uh, ilagay nyo lang yung pangalan ng co-maker nyo dito. For example, si Rogelio. Rogelio. Full name. Lagay natin. Uh, then, mobile number niya. So, pupunta yan mamaya sa credit. Unemployed, for example. Address, uh, Baguio City. Ayan natin. So, files. So, dito mga instructions lang naman na kailangan ng gawin ni member for applying loan. <laughs> so, yan. Ipapakita dito yun. So, yan. Dito sa pinakababa is may kita nyo yung amortization na, ng, ng loan nyo. So, payment one, yung interest, balance, at principal. So, automatic na siya. Then, isasubmit natin to. So, yan. Nakalagay create success. Nakalagay na yung loan application natin. So, pending loans. So, nasa member dashboard ulit ako. So, nandito sa pending loans ko is yung kaka-apply ko lang na loan, which is yung personal loan na 5,000 pesos. Then, babalik tayo sa credit. Credit committee. Balik mo tayo sa credit committee. So, far, kung may question po kayo, um, kindly, um, wag po kayong maya magtanong. So, sa credit committee, Balik po tayo. Lagi na screen. So, ayan. As you can see, dito sa dashboard, merong pending loans na pumasok. May isang pending loans na pumasok. So, loans. Ayan. Si Easy E is naglo-loan ng 5,000 pesos with a term of 6 months. So, click natin for more info. Dito nyo na makikita yung application ni, ni Mr. Easy Yan, resident address, number of dependents. Yan, may kita nyo dito yung kanya, application form niya. So, pwede natin siyang i-approve or decline. Uh, i-approve natin si Mr. Easy. Yan, so na-approve na po siya. Let's go back to loans. Then, Yan. Wala nang pending loans na nakalagay sa ating dashboard. Punta po tayo sa pending for treasurer approval. So, si Mr. Easy yung ating kan. Yung, ano, uh, na-approval. So, ito siya. So, ngayon is pending po siya for disbursement sa treasurer. So, let's check more info. So, nakalagay po dito is pending for treasurer confirmation para po i-disperse yung ilo-loan niya na pera. So, anong gagawin natin? So, pupunta tayo sa treasurer para i-approve yung disbursement ng pera. So, let's log in as treasurer ulit. So, Sir Cartier ang ating treasurer. Okay. Ayan. So, sa dashboard natin may nagpakitang request 1. Ngayon, try natin i-accept yung 1. So, from here, let's go to outflow request since maglalabas tayo ng pera. Then, loans. Ito po siya. Mandito po yung summary ng, ng loan, loan, loan approval. I mean, disbursement approval. So, view natin siya. Ayan. So, reference number, monthly interest. So, kay treasurer po to. So, disbursement method. So, pwedeng cash, check, and not online bank transactions. So, try natin yung cash. Remarks. Uh, disburse at office, for example. Then, i-approve natin siya. So, actually, mag-approve po siya yan. Pupunta po siya dito sa, sa approve ng loans. 
once na approve ko yung loans na yun, pabalik po tayo sa credit committee to check kung fully approved na yung fully approved na yung disbursement. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Yan. So, walang nagpakita dito. I think meron lang konting error. So, ganun po yung ano. Uh, ganun po yung process niya sa pag-apply ng loan. So, pwede rin mag-decline. So, pag nag-decline ng, nag ng isang member, so, dito po siya magpapakita. So, remarks can't be contacted, lacks requires information. Mag, magpapakita rin yan kay, kay member kung na-decline yung loan nila. Switch rules. So, next naman is... So far, may question po ba kayo? Mga, mga moms first. So, since walang... Wala. Let's proceed to creating a savings account. So since mag-create ulit tayo ng bagong product, pupunta ulit tayo kay, kay accountant. So click products ulit sa accountant role. So um, basic savings. Pagkawa tayo ng savings. So link account would be savings. Saving deposits. Yeah. Category savings. Ngayon natin. Deposits. Let's add the product. Yeah. So magpapakita dito yun. Basic savings. Ito yung nilagay natin na bagong product ng ating co-op. Okay. So, next step is mag-apply si member ng savings. So, to apply a savings, let's go to view all savings. Then, apply for a new savings account. Since hindi pa gumagana itong deposit via ARCS, punta tayo sa over the counter. To apply savings. So, ito. So, ang, ang, ang gagawin dito is mag-apply po tayo ng, what, ng deposit account. So, saving test. Wait lang po. View all savings. So, yan. Uh, this, so, new application. So, let's say saving test. So, uh, um, uh, my bad. Uh, Pabata pa po wala tayo sa what? Sa credit committee pala, credit uh, savings category. Sorry. So, since nakakreate tayo ng account, pupunta po tayo sa credit committee to edit po yung savings category. So, from set home, punta po kayo sa settings, add savings category. So, yung kanina is basic savings. Lagay natin basic savings for members. Then, select savings product. So, yung nilagay natin is basic savings. Yan. Description. This is the basic 
savings for members. Members of this call. Yeah. So, pwede nyo ilagay din yung minimum deposit. So, 1,000 pesos, 500. Yan. Pwede nyo siya pong ilagay dyan. So, interest term. So, paano ba magkaroon ng interest term? Yung deposit na nilalagay natin. So, monthly interest rate, 2%. Yan. Then, add new savings. So, successfully created. So settings, kung meron po kayong uh, maling na ilagay doon sa category na po yun, pwede nyo po siyang i-edit ulit or i-view. Yan, basic savings. Dito po siya magpapakita sa view or edit savings category sa settings ng credit committee. Edit category. Yan, so pwede nyo siyang i-edit kung may, meron kayong nakalimutan ilagay or maling na ilagay. Let's go back ta. Then, puna tayo kay member. So, mag apply si member ng mag apply si member ng savings account. So, view all savings from the dashboard. Click view all savings. Then, apply for new savings account. Yan. So, over the counter. So, yan. Send your deposit. So, since squad, mano-mano uh, po yung pagka-send dito. Bale, mag-gagawa lang tayo ng application form. So, basic savings for members ang ating account. Ang ating i-deposit is 1,000 since 1,000 yung minimum. Select mode of payment. So, cash, gcash. So, cash muna. Try natin cash. We agree. So, since cash tayo, hindi natin kailangan to. Pero pag gagawa tayo ng bank transfer, dito natin iliba bank transfer sa account na to. Ayan. So, cash tayo. Submit. So, success. Success na po yung pag-create ng deposit application. So, any more questions po sa credit committee role? Hello, sir. Ay, sige, sir. Hello po, sir. Paano, sir, kung magdagdag ng deposit, sir? The same process? O edit lang yung amount? Um, si member po ba ang magde-deposit? Magdadagdag po siya ng amount for deposit? Yes, sir. Halimbawa, may deposit na agad. Apo. Uh, next other day, nagdagdag siya ng deposit. Ah, yes, sir. Uh, yes po. Ah, sir, uh, pwede nyo po siyang mag-deposit ka agad. Matadagdag na po yun sa ano niya. For example po, ako magde-deposit ngayon. Punta po tayo kay member. View all savings. Same process din po siya. Hello, sir. Uh, new application din, sir, o dagdagan lang yung amount? Adadagdagan lang po yung amount. Saan? Sa ano naman sir? Sa share capital? Ah, uh, share Kapa capital. Kapatayo doon. <laughs> next, so, next topic. Next topic pa po yung share capital. Ah, sige sir. Thank you. I see. Any more questions pa po for the, sa mga kasama po natin dito? So, so, yun po yung pag, sa pag-apply ng, sa pag-apply ng savings and loans. Mostly, um, um, konti lang pa po yung, ayan. so, pwede nyo rin pong i-check yung loan calculator po dito. So, yung loan amount. Kung ilan po yung terms na kailangan yung yun. ano yung interest rate.
Main settings and controls. Sir, question? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sir, straight line po ba always yung interest? Competition interest? Uh, wait lang, sir. Ayan. Um, hindi. <laughs> uh, yung sa interest competitions ng loan, uh, palagi po siyang effective interest o yung um, uh, declining balance. Ah, uh, declining. Tapa. As uh, required by financial reporting standards din po. Although yung computation sa amortization schedule, uh, always effective interest rate po yan based on the principal amount uh, or the amount being borrowed. Uh, as to how you will enter that, nasa accountant na po yun. Uh, say for example, nag-skip uh, uh, nag ng payment, etc. Uh, ultimately, it is si, uh, si accountant po yung mag-a-adjust doon. So yung matutulungan po namin, ay maitutulong po namin sa inyo so far, is doon po sa application, sa initial computation process. But subsequent to that, it will be the accountant's role na uh, to update the records of the member, the ledgers, ayun, and to compute for the interest rates. So parang reference na lang po lahat po doon sa application form. Ano, so at the same time, sa enforcement, meaning collection, uh, up to the uh, credit committee na rin po yun. Oh, okay po, sir. Thank you. So kung napapansin niyo po the entire uh, the, the entire process yung sa yung credit committee role uh, mapapadali ng gusto yung trabaho nila ano um, in a sense and all, all of these are available sa dashboard ng credit committee so pwede nilang i-record ay pwede nilang uh, balikan pwede nilang i-review yung mga applications so hindi lang sa approval process, uh, computation at sa approval process, hanggang po sa management po ng loan. Ano, um, pwede po nilang i-monitor po. Yun. Um, and eventually, pag meron na tayong analytics, malalaman din po natin kung gaano ka good payer yung isang member. Ano, so this can be, this can form as a basis for your credit scoring model. Ano, uh, or yung, yung pag-manage nyo ng risk nung in nung loan portfolio po ng ng cooperative. So again, ang aim po natin talaga is mapadali yung trabaho po ninyo so that you could focus on the decision making part or the uh, policy making part or process in the growth of the cooperative. Ano, dahil nga personally nakita rin po namin yun, yung credit roll po uh, isa sa pinakamatrabaho. Ng maminsan gamin ti ano nakita tayo tano credit roll as tataga approve da lang ti maminsan nan pay nga magnege credit committee you know? in this case in this uh, system we enforce na dapat merong trabaho talaga yung credit committee to really review ultimately kasalanan ng credit committee kung bakit nila inapprove ano hindi naman kasalanan pero they're primarily responsible for the loans so very critical ano yung function ng credit committee in any cooperative ano because two prongs yan eh dalawa yung tinitingnan palagi diyan eh uh, yung loans at saka yung savings so dapat na ma-manage both the inflow of cash and the outflow of cash ano uh, kaya nga po lumalaki and this could be a growth uh, growth um, area for the cooperative and this is what we experience as well na Yan yung talagang i-manage ng, ng cooperative. Malaming lumaking cooperative simply because they were able to properly manage the, uh, the, the, the loans at saka yung savings products ng cooperative. Ano, so marami pong nabubuhay na co-op because of that. Ano, so we recognize the importance. Kaya kung nakita nyo parang ano, we've given you um, yung the same, ano, even more, much more efficient ano, na system uh, na ginagamit ng mga banko. Nasa sa inyo na po yun. Ano, para gamitin. Ano, uh, you'll be surprised. Ano, this would be a lot more efficient sometimes than many of the bank systems. Ano, dahil nga sinimulan namin recently yung development nito and we've made use of the most modern ano, 
uh, programming environment. Kaya very efficient din po siya. Although meron at meron yan mag, mga errors, expect, ano, dahil hindi naman namin makikita, ilan lang din po yung uh, kasama po namin sa development team. Pero once na na-raise nyo naman po yung concerns nyo doon, uh, we'll try to make it as fast as possible. So, uh, ang isa pang magiging feature nito soon is yung uh, payment gateway po natin. So, kung narinig nyo na pa yung Kaya Payment Network o kaya yung basically yung bank net, etc. So, uh, meron po, po tayong magiging payment partner later on wherein pwede po kayong mangolekta or pwede mag-deposit uh, via debit credit card or bank uh, uh, ano to? Bank uh, Uh, Basta debit, bank, or and it, yeah, e-wallets, e-wallets. So Gcash, Paymaya. So pwede po kayong mag-accept ng ganong payments or deposits or loan payments soon. Ano, uh, pero may charge kasi pinapasa lang namin yung charge ng partner namin. Hindi po charge namin yun. Uh, charge ng partner namin. Ano, uh, that will be in the future, near future. Ano yung payment uh, platform po natin within the arcs then. Ano, so ibig sabihin kayo mismo as co-op, ano, pwede kayong tumanggap ng GCash deposits, di ba? Pwede kayong tumanggap ng uh, debit deposits. O kaya pag may online banking yung members ninyo, pwede kayong tumanggap ng loan payments through um uh, land bank, uh, BPI, etc. So just how powerful ano yung system kung kung kaya niyo lang po talagang i-tweak ng gusto. And then, sa amin, gusto rin namin i-optimize nyo. Gamitin nyo talaga yung system because it's very powerful. Ano, uh, nasasayangan kami pag hindi na ma-maximize yung use nung, nung system. Ano. So, yeah. Back to you, Jester. Ayan. Ayan. So, any other more questions po from the operatives? So, Sir Jeremy, uh, pasa ko nga sa house po namin. Ayan, so thank you, Jester. So, do you do we have a question po? For... Ayan. Ayan, patype naman po ako sa ating chat box ng number two kung andyan pa po kayo. Hello, Sir. Pahawal na question. Ayan, si Sir Nurgile ito. Sir, go po. Question po. Uh, sa credit committee lang ba mag-create uh, ng loan application? Hindi, sir. Yung, ano yung parameters ng mga loan, sir? Parameters. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sa credit committee po, lang po. Para kung mag-apply yung member, automatic na na-compute na yun, sir. Uh, yes sir, automatic na compute na yun pag nilagay niyo po yung mga interest terms, ay interest, yung terms, saka yung mga minimal, minimum amount, maximum, automatic, automatically na makakompute yun pag naglagay si member. Ay pag nag-apply si member ng loan. Uh, sige sir, thank you. Ayun sir, thank you rin sir. Yeah. So, I just want to emphasize lang yun, sir. So, bali, sir, if ever po yung member nyo mag-apply ng loan, meron po sa kanilang member dashboard yung uh, yung loan application. So, mag-apply lang po sa si members doon. Tapos, yung application nyo po is dediretso sa loan, sa so may credit. And, ayan, mag-check po ng credit committee natin. At, ayan, i-verify po natin lahat ng information and so on and so forth. And, ayan, So nakadepende na po sa ko kung tatawagan kung ano po yung mga treatment natin sa kanila and for approval. Ayan. So can be approval, pending, or decline. Depende po sa inyo. Ayan. So same lang. So parang ginagawa lang po natin sa sa papel. Pero ngayon lang, ngayon lang po is on pure. Nasa online na po tayo. So ayan. Less hassle po sa atin. Yun na po nila kailangan mag-sulat-sulat. And yes, so do we have other questions po regarding sa credit? Ayan. 
going once. Okay, kanina number two. Patayin naman mo ako ng number three kung naintindihan po natin yung discussion ni Sir Jester. Ayan. Yes, number three. So yes, number three. Ayan, so 16 million ang participants natin. Charot. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so next discussion natin ngayon ay Ayan. So let's call on Kurt. Kurt, do we have more? Ayan. Um, so wow, tapos na pala. <laughs> okay, medyo mobilis lang pala yung discussions ngayon. So anyways, um, so yung susunod po naman is yung sa quiz and feedback form na. Since wala na po tayong questions. So isesend ko na po yung link dito sa chat. Ayan. Okay. So um do so the video naman would be available to you via YouTube meron ulit pong ibibigay link afterwards and your uh certificates as well. Uh, I just would want to emphasize ano uh, I think uh, our team has been calling um all of you ano lahat po ng cooperative para po makapag-set ng either visit kung you are within Metro Baguio or if you're outside of Baguio uh, pwede pong mag-video call or through uh, call conference po tayo. Um, we're doing this one because uh, we really want you to maximize the use of the system and, and based on the previous week's feedback. And also we can do face-to-face -face if you're within uh, Metro Baguio or if we're in travel, we're on travel and we'll be going to um, to your province. Ano, baka po mag-visit din po kami. Ano, um, since medyo maluwag na ulit face-to-face. -face, so, Yun, you might uh, get uh, calls from us. I know, si Jester din po yung tatawag po sa inyo. So, um, ayan, kung, uh, I hope that you will also be uh, responsive. Ano? Um, because this is free. Kami pa mag po ng, ng, ng transfer ng tao po natin na pupunta sa inyo. So, um, I, I hope you also take this opportunity. Although we'll be offering it naman from time to time. Don't worry. Ano, only that... Uh, Yun nga, kung available po yung team po namin, we will really go. Ano, um, but uh, please note that we are also starting to expand to other areas beyond the Cordillera region. So habang po available po yung team po natin, ano, pati ano, uh, in, pag mag-request po sila, pag tumawag po sa inyo, sabihan nyo na po ng schedule, mag-set na po agad ng schedule. Ano, especially if you'll be having your new set of officers or uh, a board, Ano, uh, please do uh, be uh, please include it as part of your uh, of your discussions or your agenda para po um, ano, habang uh, free pa po yung ating team ano, before we start uh, going outside of the Cordillera region. So ayun po. So tatawag-tawag po, mangungulit po yung ating team ano, from time to time. So please do take advantage of them. Uh, I think I also would want to thank ano, yung, uh, who, th those who hosted us last week, uh, si Timber and Lime. Timber and Lime, cooperative. Uh, si Sir Bidi po yung kanilang representative. Very thankful po kami and that you hosted our team. And hopefully naging useful po yung, um, yung, uh, yung pagbisita po nila ano, sa, sa inyo. So uh, again, if you're in Metro Baguio, please let us know so that we can set a schedule for our visit. Ano yung visit naman po na yan? Um, uh, we, we would appreciate kung nandun po yung mga uh, parties involved or yung mga roles involved para po uh, mabigyan na agad ano, ng, ng kaliwanagan or at least uh, clarity as to yung mga roles nila, yung functions nila, and how, how, how they can maximize the use of the system. Ayun. So, thank you very much po ulit ano, um, for doing your feedback form uh, and uh, attendance. Peace, peace, peace. Ano, um, uh, if, if hindi pa po kayo natatawagan ni Jester, uh, uh, message nyo lang po ngayon siya so that uh, he can schedule a call with you. Ano, uh, then eventually, baka makapag-schedule ng, uh, ng uh, uh, another deep dive ano, uh, or face-to-face -face, uh uh, discussion with you. Yeah. Thank you very much. 
Yeah, thank you Sir Kevin for that wonderful reminder. Again. At saka baka kung may tanong pa po kayo regarding sa membership. By the way, there were changes in the membership process kung napansin niyo po. Mostly phone number na po yung ginagamit. Ano pero hindi po talaga namin matanggal yung email address. Um although sa validation, ang requirement na lang po is yung phone number. Ano pero yung sa mga emails, notification, Uh, yung mga confirmation, um, lahat po yun via email pa din eh, dahil mahahaba kasi po yun eh. Uh, pero yung confirmation code via phone number na po yun. Ano, so kung napansin nyo po, kapag meron po kayong mga bagong members, doon po sa phone number yung confirmation. Uh, we'll also be doing some shift uh, bago po tayong uh, model, uh, uh, parang major update next week or in the next two weeks. Uh, so, baka po medyo mapahaba yung ating maintenance. You know? uh, so, pero don't worry, we'll try to make it as fast as possible din. So, marami pong development na nangyayari po sa ARCs. You know? um, I'm excited na kayo po yung first na gumagamit. <laughs> At least, uh, and if you have any problems or errors that you encounter, please, please, please do let us know immediately para matulungan namin po kayo. Ayan, may, baka may, may issues pa rin po kayo sa onboarding na ng mga members po ninyo. Pwede nyo pong itanong para matake note na po rin namin agad. And yes, ayan. Thank you Sir Kevin for that wonderful reminders again. Ayan. So, as of now, so meron na po tayong feedback form sa ating comment chat box. And, ayan. So, mahaba-haba pa naman ang oras natin. So, magtatanong lang ako before we will invite the Sir Gion for a closing remarks. Pero mamaya pa naman yun. So, ngayon, uh, magka-question magka -question lang po muna tayo kay... Ayan. So, unahin po natin si Ma'am Faye, ayan, from Excite Credit Cooperative. Hi, Ma'am Faye. Uh, Mag-interview lang po tayo ng mga sampung question. Hi, Ma'am. Ayan. Good morning, Ma'am. Ma'am, okay lang po ba na mag... Ano? Uh, <laughs> ano talaga eh. Ma'am, so far, ano po yung na-experience natin sa arts? Actually, hindi kasi ako yung humahawak sa account namin. Ngay ngayon pa lang ako first na naka-join sa uh, training. Tapos na-late pa ako kasi may meeting pa kami. Ah, okay. So, oo, pero pinakita naman sa akin ni Karil, so far yung sa registration ay yung pag-onboard ng mga members namin sa system, okay naman siya. Okay naman. So, uh, ma'am, pa lang kasi kami. Yes, from membership role po kayo, ma'am. So, oo. Uh, uh oo. -oh. Kayo po si Ma'am Faye, Ma'am. Oo. Ayan. So, magandang umaga po, Ma'am. So, Good morning. Thank po for joining us today. And so, Ma'am, Ma if ever po na may problem or naguguluhan po kayo sa pag-onboard ng mga members and some committee, uh, message nyo lang po kami, Ma'am, para alalayan po namin kayo agad. Yes po. Thank okay. you. Thank you, Ma'am. Have a good day po. And yes, from, ayan, si Ma'am Hilda. Kuy, kuyen. Ayan. Good morning, Ma'am. Hilda. Ma'am Hilda, nag-istorya uh, tayo pa. Ayan, so far, uh, ano yun si Ma'am Hilda. So, as naman po natin si Sir Norgi dito. Ayan, Sir, our active participants. Yes, Sir. Yes, Sir. So far, ah, uh, Ado tin encounter yung uh, parang pagbabago sa system niyo. So far sir, anya nga itinay bagayot di system tata. From the day we start. Diya lang han ko lang mo open ito y... <laughs> pati login ti ka. Login. Sir, ada pa lang bagzi kasla agra round. Awan ni sir pag bit lang ako agad to kan nagsublima ni awan. Okay. So so sir ngam tata nakakonek na makay sa wifi or naka lan. Nakaka-connect sa Wi-Fi, sir. Okay, sir. So, sir, uh, 
Ayan. So, hindi naman sa pag ng mga internet company. So, anya ti? O, sorry, yung tatas yung kawan? Internet connection. PLDT. PLDT. Good, sir. Okay. So, let's check, sir. Mahit mo ti, kawan? Connection yung kinyami. Why is that? Ano? Walang lumalabas na landing page. Hindi okay. nga pure white ba, sir? Or white. Mas... Pure nga blanco, sir. Pure nga blanco. Well, sir, I want to makita nga pa, sir. Okay. Ayan. So, nakikita natin concern dito, sir, is the internet connection or yung ano, yung tawag dito? Yung performance hmm? ng laptop. Mga tanga, dumakal di ko, sir. No, hanggang ma-open ti laptop di ay graphics na, sir. Uh, ahan mo ti sir. So, ito naman, sir, yung Uh, uh, pagmayatan na di system tayo which is mabalin nyo nga i-open from other laptop or unit data kwan. so hindi lang po siya nakatenga sa isang unit so kahit madadaal or pa-repair tayo sa laptop mabalin nyo pa nga i-open from other laptop yung ano na to yung system natin so di ay so kanya maiwasan ayan sir Kevin the may uh, yeah um Apa yung nga madi? Tatalang ba data, sir, nga nagka-issue? Uy, sir, tatalang mo, sir, nga huwag mo ti ma-open niya. Makita nga log-in niya. Uh, Chrome ba d'yo susarin niyo, sir? Chrome mo, sir. Uh, Dapat ti sa bali yung uh, pan-browser, internet browser. Edge? Uh, uh, Mozilla Firefox? Mozilla? Ah, uh, sir. Ada? Uy, sir, parehas. Right. Kaduha da ito yung sarag nga ko. Pag sinsinubla tayo ka wala ka mag sir. Uh, arcs.ph sir. When sir? Uh, mabalin pa. Uh, dati i-chat ko tata ta, AJ. AJ uh, dito yung chat box tayo. Uh, mabalin nga eh. Pa-type J dito yung arcs. Uh, HTTPS. Uh, dati ko nga uh, i-open sir. Ngayon, sir. Try you, man. Ah, uh, sir. Ada. Dito yun ko. Okay. So, Magbalin possible. Ada, sir. Ada. Try you, man. Nag-login. Ano, kung mabilis. Login. Oh, na-open, sir? Na-open, sir? Open, sir. May at. Ah, okay, okay. So, um, usaran nyo na lang, sir, dito yung HTTPS. Uh, dito yung i-copy-paste na lang pa yung dito. Ano, Open, sir. Um, Kada dito, namin in-implement ng security headers recently. So, ibig sabihin na lang, dito yung um, dapat security connection nyo palagi. Um, mm -hmm. So, dito yung matka-standard for um, banking website. Nagiti da, nagiti da banks, nagiti da financial institution, iso mati standard na requirement na so, um, ang dito implement ng additional level of security uh, para ayon, para ma, uh, para ma secure the connection tayo the system. so baka idi nag transition kami jay, uh, di yan nga, kailangan nga i-update mo lang kita, di uh, uh, pag di na save yung uh, um, yeah. URL na or the link. So, Uy, sir. Baka nag... Uh, Mayat na, sir. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Ayan. So, clear na po yung concern natin kay Sir Nergilito. So, so far, sir, uh, aside from yung ano, na-encounter nyo na problem regarding po sa mga rules natin from membership, ayan, uh, kasi kayo nakikita namin na active talaga na nagpa-participate from your co-op, so representative talaga. So, So far, sir, uh, may na-encounter po ba pa rin tayong problem sa pag-order ng mga members? Jay, kwa lang, sir. Jay, pagkwa lang ti membership. Talaga nga, marayata na kay Jay. Jay kwa. May tatata inquiry ti phone number. <laughs> yes, sir. E, mabaling nga i-request ko ito nga i-delete na ito doon mga inquactaan ko nga maipasok nga talaga. 
tatno ma-repress ko may ni Kwak ID. Manibagong na i-member ko. Sir, mabaling isan yung kanyami. At least yung email address na lang. At na-delete ni. When sir, when sir. Kwak to nung walpas dito i-patayo sa'yo. At na i-delete ko. At na mabaling ni manan nga sir. When sir, tatno. So, tas na press start. I-repasok ko iso da sir. Ma-repress dito yung memory tip at i-arc sir. No man sir. Sige sir. Send you lang kay Jami. Okay. So thank you sir na really ito. Ayan. So we really acknowledge talaga. And appreciate you. Dahil ayan. So ayan. Maswerte na merong na really ito sa kanilang co-op kasi siya na mismo ang nagtatrabaho. Lahat-lahat. And yes! Yes! So another participants natin. Let's call on Sir Billy. Ayan. Sir Billy Joe. Ayan. Good morning, sir. Hello, Sir Billy. Ayan. So far, wala pa po. Si Ma'am Hilda nasa meeting daw po siya. And Sir Dindo. Ayan. I-request naman po natin sa Sir Dindo. Hello, Sir Dindo. Magandang umaga again. Hello. Yes. Yes. Yes, sir. Sir, ah, question lang po regarding po sa experience natin sa pag-onboard ng mga members and sa paggamit ng ating system. Ayan. So, first sir, ano po yung experience natin? May naikanter po ba tayong problem or? Well, nakal nakasalfon lang kasi ako ngayon. Hindi ako naka hindi ako naka Hands on, kasi nakalimagdamir yan yung wala masyado nagpapansin. Laptop. Hindi ko siya makontak. Wala masyado nagpapansin. Pero sir, nagagamit po natin yung system. Hindi ko pa na na ano, na hindi ko kasi makontak si Madam Miriam eh. Kung kasi siya yung membership committee eh. Yes, sir. So, uh -oh. aso kayo, sir, yung super admin? Oo, uh oo, -oh, uh oo. -oh. Okay, sir. So, so far, sir, naman, dun sa uh, nakita po natin, uh, madali po ba siyang ano, sundan? Madali naman, oo. Oh. Kaya lang, di ba, uh, may darating naman na face-to-face? Ah, yes, sir, but uh -oh. if, if you Parang want... Parang in inesked namin after this... General. After next week, di ba? Oh, after ne after this after this week yata, nisked namin yung face to face. Kasi may tumawag sa amin, yun nga nag kung pwede kaming mag face to face para yes. ma, ma ano na siya lahat, ma, ma clear out na lahat. Yes, sir. So next week, sir, or after the Holy Week. Ano ba ano ba next week? Pwede o oh, pwede na siguro sir next week. Ikaw yung sir, ko ano yung ano niyo? Ay yes sir, schedule na po natin sir yung ano, yung face to face natin. So we will visit your co-op po. Oo, oh, oo. So, oh, oh, Relay ko na lang po na. dito kay Sir Jester para ma ayan, ma-schedule oh, na po natin. Oo. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay sir, thank you Sir Dindo. Ayun. Yeah, so si Sir Din, si Sir Belly naman. Ayun, Sir Belly Joe. Ayan, going once, Sir Billy, going twice, going thrice. Okay, and now let's call on naman Mr. Just, ay Mr. Tuloy. Ayan, Miss Justin Ferrer. Hello, Miss Justin. Okay na ba yung mic mo? Ayan, so far wala pa naman. So ngayon, let's call on naman Miss Sunshine. Hi Sunshine. Ayan. So far ano yung ano na experience mo sa paggamit ng system? Nagagamit niyo ba yung system as of now? Yes po, hello. Yes. Yes ma'am. Ayan. Ayan, so far nagagamit niyo ba yung ARCs? or the advanced robust cooperative system? Uh, 
sa aming COP is yung sa uh, for for the meantime is uh, hindi pa pero na try na namin doon sa uh, accounting membership uh, and sa actually na try lahat kaso sa akin kasi sa part ko is uh, nag shift kasi ako from accounting to credit so credit. Uh, oh, first time kung gamitin yung credit dashboard ngayon. Okay, based on your experience sa accounting, so far, uh, ano yung nakita mo ano? Parang uh, may suggestion ka or ano yung nagustuhan mo sa system na yun? Yeah, very, very talagang nakakatulong yung sa accounting part. Uh, makaka-relate yung mga nasa accounting field since... Uh, yung mga reports na natin is automatic na naandun sa andun sa system. So, ang problema na lang natin is yung sa pag-input ng ating mga transactions. Ooh, so, so far, uh, nakakatulong sa mga field of accountant. So, sa tingin mo, Miss Sunshine, nakakatulong ba to sa mga non-accountant? Oh, actually, oo. Since, uh, basta may background naman, may, ay kahit konting background sa accounting, uh, yung mga terms naman is uh, hindi as in pang-accounting lang. So, yung mga ibang non-accountants din at least uh, ano bang tawag doon? <laughs> uh, yung mga non-accountants is kasi naka-general yung terms niya. Hindi lang hindi lang yung mga deep uh, naka-tawag ba doon? Hindi ko makuha yung term niya. <laughs> ah, naka-layman's term. Yung mga terms na nagagamit sa accounting. So, pwede siya sa mga non-accountants din. Okay. So, ayan guys. So, ang ginamit po nating mga terms for the accounting is na kuha rin po natin sa standard ng CDA. So, siguro po, hindi po kayo mabibigla dun sa mga nandun. Sa mga particular name or account name na nandun. And yes, Miss Sunshine, you said a while ago na nag-transition ka into credit committee, so far naman madali bang sundan or, or pag-assist natin sa credit, credit rule? Uh, so, yung napanood ko kanina is madali naman siya. Check na lang natin afterwards <laughs> kung masusundan. So, okay. So, gusto mo na siyang i-apply? Mm-mm. Actually, excited na ako. Yeah. So yes, Sunshine is excited from Online Community Credit Cooperative. So Online Community Credit Cooperative is a startup co-op. So mag two two years pa lang siya this May. Oh, di ba? Mag two two years pa lang. Yes, so, yeah. so pandemic co-op ang co-op nila. And yes, so as of now, thank you sa mga feedback niyo. So if ever po na mga may mga question tayo, concern, mga suggestion, you open up nyo lang po sa amin. Tu- magtulungan po tayo. At nandito lang naman po kami. As sabi nga ni Sir Kevin, kung gusto nyo po mag-schedule uh, for face-to-face appointment, pupuntahan po namin kayo sa outside of Baguio, 